What's happening YouTube, it's your boy Tech Tricks back around the video and today I'm going to show you how to fix your phone when it has that black screen. Here we go! First things first, make sure to hit that subscribe button below, hit that notification bell so you can be notified of the next videos to come of tips and tricks on your iPhone and your Android. Check out my merch below at 1130.ta. And here we go. And today we're looking at iOS system recovery for Windows. This way you'll be able to recover your iOS slash tvOS to normal with all iOS system issues repaired efficiently, including iPhone recovery mode, white Apple logo, black screen, Apple TV issues, and more without even losing any of your data. With this as well, you can repair in 50 iOS problems in iPhone, iPad, iPad Touch, any iDevice you got, this will be able to help you to fix it. With Toonskit iOS system recovery, you are able to quickly fix any common iOS, tvOS issue all by yourself without seeking help from Apple technical specialists. No matter whether your iOS device stuck in recovery mode, DFE mode, white Apple logo, maybe you're jailbreaking and something went wrong and or becomes black, blue, frozen, disabled screen, this smart iOS repair tool will get you out of trouble and recover your device back to normal and easily and efficiently. Without further ado, let's go ahead and test this out. So what you need to do first is download this program to your computer. Make sure it's a Windows computer as well. It's not going to work in Mac, unfortunately. I'll link it down in the description below. So go ahead and check that out. Go click that and download it. Second, what you need to do is uh, connect your phone, your, your, fro your phone that is frozen or black screen or white screen uh, stuck in the Apple logo, plug that into your computer. Now there's a couple of disclaimers before we go through this. Uh, this is not gonna fix the hardware failure. Let's say your screen is a problem or maybe your um, battery is not working. This will not fix that. This is only for software issues. Now here you can see here if your phone is recognized by the computer, it says this Porus iPhone, that's my iPhone 6S Plus. Here you'll be able to do all these uh, repairs uh, stuck on white Apple logo, black screen, boot loop, connect to iTunes, slide to upgrade screen, recovery mode, DFU mode, headphone mode, data recover process. And a lot more really uh, we can scroll down even more here uh, even if, when your phone is your iphone is frozen disabled uh, bricked uh, maybe you have no idea what's going on maybe when your ipad is bricked as well this happens a lot when you're jailbreaking your phone so this is something that can help you recover it um, iphone boot logo crash blue screen uh, iphone keeps restarting activation error you could do all this with this um, maybe your iPhone won't turn on, iPad as well, this would do the same. Uh, iPhone red screen, uh, iPhone won't turn off, keeps turning off, right? Or maybe it keeps turning off, I won't update, uh, maybe it failed to update. So you can use this device as well or software so that you'll be able to update your phone to the latest software. You don't even need iTunes for this. Um, this will work. Uh, without even calling Apple or anything like that, you'll be able to do this right at home. Now, our iPhone 6S Plus is stuck on black screen. What we'll need to do is just click that and press start. Now, there's two ways to fix this. There's the standard mode and there's the advanced mode. I prefer using standard mode because I don't lose any data. But if the standard mode doesn't work, go ahead and use advanced mode. But today, um, just to show you that option, we're just gonna use standard mode. Let's go ahead and press next. There we go. Now we're brought to this page. Let's just confirm the uh, firmware package that we want to use, making sure that this is also an iPhone 6S Plus right there and, uh, and the model that it has. You can also use a uh, different software, select that uh, firmware package, download another, uh, maybe a different version on that. You'll be able to do that right here. Let's go ahead and press download. Okay. 
there we go now that the firmware had been downloaded you can go ahead and press repair in this process we're gonna go ahead and fast forward it so that you don't have to watch through the uh, 20 minute video that is recovering my phone Now during this process, uh, everything is complete. The repair is complete. Now, hopefully our uh, data hasn't been lost during this time. Now you'll just have to wait till the phone actually uh, boots up and then uh, you'll be able to turn on your phone. So it's just amazing how um, earlier our phone wasn't able to turn on. Now uh, it's uh, well and dandy. I'm pretty sure all the data is there and everything is good to go. And that's it for today, guys. I hope I was able to help you recover your dead iPhone. Um, there's so many ways to recover your phone. Whatever the problem is, try this product out. I'll link this down in the description below. If I was able to help you, make sure to hit that like button below so that we can kick out of the curb that YouTube algorithm so that more people would know about this video. Make sure to subscribe to my channel. Uh, hit that notification bell as well so you can be notified of the next videos to come. If you have any questions, go ahead and comment that down below. Hope you guys have a good day. Stay safe out there. Peace.